Well, hello and welcome back to the channel. I hope everyone is having a great day. So we're gonna go ahead and continue with our collective reads. This will be for all signs, which means it may or may not resonate with you in your personal situation. If it does, take what resonates. If it does not, leave the rest for those that it applies in their personal situation. All right, collective, I'm continuing to pick up a more energy about whatever was going on today with that untrustworthy person that you shut down. Apparently it's a big deal in the ethers, right? Cause I'm getting some downloads to confirm this and I'll get into my downloads here in a little bit. But whatever it was, this was somebody that was just like, you know, they were having a moment. This person would have had a breakdown. You might've saw it if you were around them. You know, somebody tried to manipulate you, play you and trick you and you shut all that down. Possibly dealing with um, some work situations. I am getting a lot of work downloads. Um, possibly a, a boss or a coworker trying to give you something that was had some manipulation behind it. Um, you know, they couldn't produce something at work. So they just did, you know, gave something to you. Again, this could be your friend or family member. Take the energy as it resonates with whomever the person might be. But it was like somebody who couldn't do something, you know, but you did. You know what I'm saying? And they feel some type of way, but they were trying to play you in the first place. So make it make sense. I don't know. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? But I'm still getting more energy. So I'm, let's go ahead and get into it. Um, this page of wands and the inverse is coming out for whoever this person is. You know, this person did, did have the energy of being very fearful. They got some bad news. They're feeling very pessimistic, right? But I feel like this is kind of like what it was that was, you know, going on prior to, you know, the manipulation. Whatever it was, they got some bad news. They were feeling very pessimistic about something. They were having a bad day. Y'all, didn't I say this, uh, this energy was in the crowd? Um, the, was it not yesterday, the day before, one of them, I said this before, and it's because they had the energy of the wheel of the fortune in the inverse. They're, they're stuck, they're having delays, but it's because, you know, they wanted reward without effort. They weren't willing to work for the world, but they wanted it all. They wanted all the glory, the fame, you know, the, the notoriety. I'm, I'm getting a lot of materialism already, right? Somebody couldn't do something, but they wanted the accolades is what I'm getting really heavy in my downloads with this energy, right? So what they wanted to do, carry the eight of wands energy straight to the nine of wands, y'all. <laughs> this is like quick movement, travel, speed, relocation to the nine of wands. This is like overcoming obstacles. This is that, that can do, I can push through, I can do this, right? So somebody had something going on, right? Whatever it was that was going on. Again, I'm getting a lot of work downloads. So somebody couldn't accomplish something at work. So whether this is the boss or the coworker trying to be your boss, couldn't get something done. So they go to you, you know what I'm saying? You know, trying to overcome some type of obstacle, something that they had going on, right? But how they decided to do it was carry the fool in the inverse energy, y'all. Bad move, bad move, okay? <laughs> this is being reckless, foolish, naive, and being very, very rigid about how they go about things, right? Because it's like their ego is driving them. So a lot of, lot of wand energy already. So possibly dealing with some work or a creative project, right? Um, but it, whatever it was, whatever this um, fool and inverse energy is, it was very reckless, foolish, naive, risky, right? But all that energy, whatever they did, however they were trying to play you, manipulate you, trick you, right? They're, they're unmasked. Moon and the inverse energy is here, right? This is the energy that came out of my last reading, right? This is, you know, you see the bigger picture about this person. Um, I've got some downloads about this and I'll get to it in a second, but a lot more is coming out, especially energetically. There's more energetically going on behind this person, but it's like you unmasked this con man. I am getting a very unmasked energy about this person. Carry the Knight of Cups uh, in the inverse energy. A very obsessive person. This is somebody who can't let something go and they still don't want to let it go, y'all. I'm just, I'm just telling you, this person still doesn't want to let it go. Whoever this person is, very, very obsessive. I'd have to have control. I have to have it my way. It's like a certain, I keep getting, it's like a certain way things should be done and it's their way, according to them. Says them, right? Okay, collective. Um, this possibly might be an obsessive lover, right? Um, this possibly might be somebody, you know, you're in a romantic partnership, right? Somebody who has romantic problems, y'all are not together. So possibly an ex, again, take the energy as it resonates. But this is the person who has this chariot energy. So again, right under this nine of wands energy, is like trying to push through, overcome obstacles with this chariot energy. So they were just like, they they got something going on. However, that showed up for them, whether this work, friend, family member, or whomever, right? 
they're just like, yeah, I'm going to push through, you know, chariot energy. This is positive movement forward, confidence, courageousness. This is like pulling their inner fearfulness out. So they were, something happened. So they tried to overcome it, but how they decide to do it is in a jacked up way. So whoever this person is, is not trustworthy and they're not an upright person in the first place. And here's yet another confirmation. This person's energy is all jacked up, y'all. The star in the inverse energy is here, which is a double confirmation of this page of wands. Fearful, pessimistic, lack of faith. Lack of faith is coming out. And I've got to download about this because there's something about what's happening ethereally about this situation that I do want to share with you guys, right? This is also someone who has unrealistic wishes. So how they go about things is by manipulation. So you might as well call this devil energy right here. I'm um, looking at my little piece of paper with my downloads on. Somebody, um, it's like they don't trust you. There's a lot of mistrust in this energy. They don't trust you. So they, this person I'm getting my downloads might have went through something, might have went through my note, my uh, downloads are saying they might have went through your notes, went through your um, something in writing. Some, they might've went through your social media. They might've went through your work. They, you know, they might've went through your desk. Um, this person might've went through your things at home. Something about something, they might've went through your notes. So, because they don't trust you about something, right? But they heard you loud and clear when you spoke out about something. They heard you and it pissed them off because here you are in this two of cups energy, right? This is some type of shared feeling, some type of friendship, business partnership, relationship, whatever type of shit, right? However you are in a partner, and this is what I was saying in my last reading, because I do get the energy that you are working with somebody doing something, but somebody else doesn't trust you, which is all this negative, fearful, pessimistic energy is around you. This person does not trust you, but they're not trustworthy. Come on, make it make sense. I don't get it. You know what I'm saying? They are, it's like, um, they made a mess of things because of this. It's like in, envy and jealousy. This is exactly what it's giving me. Envy and jealousy. You can do something they can't. So they're envious and jealous of you, right? Right off the bat. They make a mess of things because they can't do something, but they're not willing to put in the work. Will of fortune and the inverse, right? Um, but you're very fortunate because you're blessed by the most high God. My download is saying, um, and I had another download, download, which is very interesting. If this person could scream or scream at you, they would have, but they're, they're kind of like holding it back. Um, maybe this person might've had an outburst that you saw. Maybe y'all got into it, but this person is like a very, it's very frustrated energy that I'm getting. Like this person wants to scream because they are now terrified of you because they not, they acknowledge how powerful you are. Um, I do get a very, um, it's like a graceful energy, like a graceful power, right? Y'all, but here's the here's the thing. The, and the main thing that I'm getting in my download, y'all, this star in the inverse, y'all have a download that's telling me something very specific about this person. This person may claim that they believe in the most high, but they don't. They don't. They really don't. They don't have faith. This star, star in the inverse is a very faithless person. They don't have faith. Which is, honey, faith over fear. It, does that ring a bell for anybody? Faith over fear. If you're fearful, where's your faith? Where is it? The Most High has always got everybody covered. You know what I'm saying? You know, the children of God, we know that we have faith over fear and faith overcomes fear, but this person lives in fear. They live in the darkness, y'all. My downloads are speaking and preaching to somebody out here. Whoever this person is, take this as it resonates. I'm feeling like somebody masquerades like they believe in the Most High, but they do not. They have no faith. Star in the inverse energy is here to confirm this. Um, I do have a, a download. These two cards were speaking to me very, very specifically. The star in the inverse coming out right next to the two of cups. You move very, very gracefully in the situation. You move with the light of the most high God. You move exactly the way the most high wanted you to in this situation. This person who is in the dark hates your light. This envy and jealousy was triggered by this person because it's your light doing it. Y'all, you've unmasked a demon or this person's demon, whatever the situation is, you know, maybe there, maybe there's somebody lost at the same time, but I get a very negative energy from this person. Their envy and jealousy was triggered just by you doing something that they can't. You unmask somebody's demon, y'all, like period, point, point. Um, my download is also saying that you mirrored the light of God back to them. So again, my download, I, I was having, had said that they believe in the most high, but they really don't. So you mirrored back the light of God to them that they say that they carried. Y'all, it's a wrap. I can just throw all these cards away. <laughs> Y'all, hey, I'm just saying, if this person walks around saying that they believe in the most high, this energy says they don't believe in nothing but their fear. Mm, they believe in nothing but the darkness. 
Who do, who do you follow again? I can't with it. I can't. The Most High's always got you covered. I don't care how dark it seems. You know, and, and, and not to say that people don't go through things. People, all people go through things. Heck, I go through things. But at the same time, I remember that the Most High's got me covered on all fronts. We are protected collective because we believe that all things, all things, he didn't say some things, come on y'all, all things work for those who love him. And I believe that 100%, I ain't got no room for doubt. Whoever this person is, doubts, okay? <laughs> they doubt, they really do. Coming up with this four swords and the inverse, y'all. The energy is right here. Four swords is overthinking, overanalyzing. What you overthinking for? You know what I'm saying? Whoever this person is, it's a lot of mistrust, but they're, it's like overthinking, overanalyzing. You know, they're being lazy. It's all the manipulation energy. That envy and jealousy is just firing on all 10 cylinders. You know what I'm saying? Um, the Knight of Pentacles and the inverse energy is here. This is them being lazy, materialistic. And this, this materialistic energy is coming out very, very heavy. It's something about they did what they did for the accolades. They wanted the praise. They, if this is somebody who gave you something that they thought that couldn't be done, <clears throat> they gave it to you because they wanted the notoriety to show that even you can't do it. The one, the most high is supposed to protect, right? If something about notoriety, this person is like, it's lazy, materialistic, and shallow. Very, very shallow, right? This person, it's like they want the accolades, but it's like they're this also person who actually, it's like they do things to be seen for doing it. You know, there's there's lots of examples for that. It's like you do you do like something, you know, but you want to be known for doing it. You know what I'm saying? Whoever this person is, they want it to shine on you, like legit, but they don't have the light. You do. Um, before I move on, I did get another download about this two of cups. This person is used to oppressing partnerships. They always have to have it their way in a partnership. However, type of ship, friendship, business partnership, relationship. This person always has to have it their way. And how they get it their way is full in the inverse and out of cups in the inverse. That's why, to get accolades, right? Now this person is feeling the, the four cups. They're not feeling happy and they feel like they missed out on an opportunity because you stepped out in your King of Pentacles energy yet again. Come on, collective. This is you definitely in that, uh, that seat of authority, right? This is uh, the energy of being stable and your foundation. Like I said, a very, I felt a very grounded energy. You cannot be rocked. This person was trying to take you off your seat of authority. The most High said, no, not my child. Touch not my anointed, okay? Um, definitely something about you being very trustworthy and disciplined. It's what allowed you to navigate this manipulation. Meanwhile, on the other side of the fence, with them trying to like shine on you to try to manipulate you to get some type of accolades to try to show up some type of way, it, it was not going to work. It, and here's the confirmation what I'm saying. Y'all, the Queen of Pentacles is out here. Before I even pulled this card, I felt that energy coming out. So you got a Knight of Pentacles in the inverse escalating to the Queen of Pentacles in the inverse. That's an escalation of being shallow and materialistic. Again, um, the Queen of Pentacles energy, I do get that very showy, show-off attitude. And this is what I keep getting the loudest. Whatever somebody did, they did it for the clout. Pair point blank collective. They did it for the clout. But they don't realize that you walk with the most high. You know, it doesn't matter who tries to come against you. They're always going to get set down. People trying to, you know, get a come up off, off of you, trying to, you know, move in their in energy of envy and jealousy just to show off with it, right? Being very irresponsible, greedy, and lazy, trying to get whatever you got. The most high said no, touch not my anointed. You know what I'm saying? You know, but whoever this person is, and this is another confirmation, Ace of Wands in the inverse uh, came out again for this person's energy. <laughs> This person's blocked energy. They can't create. They can't do work. They're not abundant. They can't do things. So whoever can't do, they try to steal from those who can, right? What's that saying? Um, those who can't do teach. You know, what, what is that? This person can't teach you anybody anything. I can't with it. This is just blocked energy, you know, lack of motivation. This is also carries the energy of male impotence. So possibly somebody who wants you that can have you, but definitely block energy. They couldn't do something. So they tried to make it seem like you, know, you couldn't do it, right? But when you could, right, with your King of Pentacles energy, shutting down the other Knight of Pentacles energy and the Queen of Pentacles energy, now they feel isolated, lonely, and rejected. Yep. And Five of Pentacles, y'all. <laughs> When I say the most high set this person down, most high set this person down. You know what I'm saying? This is, and I feel like they feel so rejected because somebody wanted you on their side, my downloader is saying. They wanted you to be with them on this, 
So that's why the manipulation was sent to you. Maybe they wanted you to kind of, you know, not see through the ruse, not see through the manipulation. But when you did with whatever your hard work is, they got set down. Um, something about something that you weren't supposed to see, but your, your King of Pentacles allowed you to see it, right? Um, they feel um, this Five of Pentacles energy. They feel left out in the cold, some type of loss, right? Some type of financial impact. Um, you got a funny download. It says they feel like you kicked them in the knees or you blindsided them. <laughs> I don't know. I'm not feeling like you kicked them in the knees, but whatever they did, this is the, 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 you know, the rewards for their misdeeds, right? You know what I'm saying? Now they carry the five of swords in the inverse. They got to walk away from this conflict, but you better believe they're going to carry resentment, y'all. I told y'all this energy was going to come out. And didn't I also say that this person was going to have an emotional breakdown? Here it go. You looking for me? Here I go. Nobody's looking for you. Go sit down. <laughs> y'all, another confirmation. This person's not happy. This person won't let it go. They won't let it go. This Ten of Cups in the inverse is being very discontent very not happy they're not committed right then this is definitely something like they really feel very very low right you know some type of you know d divorce separation they they feel non-committed right very very unhappy with whatever the situation is and however it resonates because of the eight of pentacles told you it's about your hard work heavy pinnacle energy however this showed up whether this was a work situation whether this had something to do with money things, things that are earthbound. It had everything to do with your hard work, your skill, your practice, and your training. What you do, how you maneuver through things, you know, you're being trustworthy, being disciplined in your energy, how you go about your work, you know? And this is, it's like you, the, the person who actually does the work at the job gets them, gets the money, you know what I'm saying? That's the way it's supposed to work. Yeah, but you're proving that, right? collective so it's like the the lazy wanted the reward but put no work in but now you're getting the reward because you put in the work you know what i'm saying and now they're <laughs> this eight of cups and the inverse energy is here they're stuck you know they can't move on and they don't want to take responsibility for what they do no because i'm telling y'all they wanted rewards off of your work but your work outshadowed them. They don't like to be um, out overshadowed, is what I'm hearing, overshadowed by you. One, they don't like it. That's why it's so painful for them, right? That's why they're not happy. It's something about you doing this. You're like the underdog to this person, or at least somebody they don't think is worthy. Ugh. Told you there's a lot of mistrust in the energy, right? Y'all, this person is continuing to carry the, the Ten of Wands, right? They're feeling a lot of pressure. They're feeling burdened and overwhelmed. It's something about you doing this. This person didn't think that you would be able to do this, but you did, right? And now that you did, whatever their efforts were, were all Three of Wands in the inverse. It was a waste of time. It did not turn out as they hoped. And it's sort of last clarified because you're the magician. You're way too powerful for this person. <laughs> I told y'all, y'all, this was something big in the ethers. They were messing with somebody who really does co-create with the universe, who the most high is protecting. You're the most high, your spirit guides and your ancestors are around you. When people are trying to come at you with some type of envious and jealous in energy, you're always going to be protected because you didn't do anything in the situation except for work hard. That was it. Do what you're supposed to do. You know, if this is a relationship, you know, that just just being a normal person, trying to be in a relationship with somebody who's not trustworthy, lazy, and they just wanted to come up off of you, who is competing with you. I can't, y'all. People out here be competing with their mates, and I don't get it, right? You're too powerful for them. They didn't deserve you anyway, magis magician. You have a lot of power. You have a lot of skills. Something about how logical you are. You got a lot of smarts. You got, you, got, you got stuff going on up there, right? But like I told you before, Collective, it's not about uh, not only about what's on the earthbound, heavy pinnacle energy, it's about what's in the ethers. You are being celebrated in the ethers, and I'm feeling this in your energy. This is a celebration. This is also a part of why your energy is so positive right now. You are being celebrated in the ethers, and I celebrate you too. Let's get a visions of duality, and we'll get some advice for our Collective. Card three, visions made prophecies. Yeah, it was like this person had a one-track mind, right? On one side, vision is the ability to create the future we see, and foresight is a strong hand on the helm against the wind and current. But vision itself can become tunnel vision, forcing our senses and our mind on a prearranged path of our own making. Hmm. That is blind to everyone else as well, be it wonder, opportunity, or choice. And sometimes certainty is the strongest shackle. Boy, what I just say? <laughs> Advice, beware of what you are calling wisdom as you may create a self-fulfilling prophecy. 
Um, and there's a quote by J.R.R. Tolkien, for, for even the wise cannot see all ends. This person did not see their end because they were getting shut down with your magician energy. This person thought they were wise by whatever type of manipulation, trickery, and reckless um, energy they were coming coming at you with, but they didn't see this end. That they were just not going to be happy trying to come against you. They didn't know how powerful you were. Let's get a perfect card and we'll wrap up. Card 30. Let your best be for your friends. Um, this is clearly a lesson that they need to learn because... Um, you're out here doing your best, right? And let there be no purpose in friendship, save the deepening of the spirit. For love that seeks aught, but the disclosure of its own mystery is not love, but a net cast forth. And only the unprofitable is caught. And let your best be for your friend. Yep, this is a lesson that this person should should have learned or should be learning in this particular situation. However, this person you know resonates in your situation, friend, family member, the ex, the the, the boss, the coworker trying to be your boss, or somebody you just met. Somebody did not save their best for you, but at the same time, your best is co-creating with the universe. That whole magician energy came out for you, collective, while you're working your hardest, doing your best. Somebody created their own self-fulfilling prophecy. That's going to go ahead and do it for this particular reading. If you do like this content, don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe. And until the next time, bye-bye.